hey guys thank you for clicking on this video welcome back to my channel so if you're new to this channel guys my name is solange i'm a mom of four kids and i'm based in douala cameroon so guys i want to first of all start this video by thanking you guys for subscribing to my channel like what have i done to deserve this much love right like when i post a video and i see over 100 people watching my videos and i'm like whoa like that is a lot right so i'm i just want to tell you guys that i am just so very grateful i say thank you for always watching my videos like i know you got my back that is why i feel free to always come and rant on this youtube when i have the necessary time guys today i'm not going to sit here and pretend that i'm so happy i have been so pissed up like this video was not even supposed to have an intro uh, uh, but because i was so angry i tried coming down like i am just so tired the way i don't know i don't know how to put it if it is stigmatization of women like i don't get why people always hype men a lot like why is it that everywhere everywhere is like we women need to do this to have good husband to have a good husband women need to do this to be to 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 in fact, everything, mostly women are the ones that are supposed to do something for the husband. Like, I am so pissed off at this point in time because... So there is this meeting, like, it is in my video, right? So there is this meeting that I just joined, right? It is about... It is, a, it is within our age group. You get... It is within our age group and this meeting is basically it is because it is our age group like it is from 90 to 92 that is the age so it is like a social and social and jangi stuff you get what i'm saying but so today i think that there in that meeting the purpose is that all of us we are equal you get married or not married it is the age group so there are rules definitely there are rules and regulation there okay so yeah this meeting is composed with men and women you get some are married some are not married but this is what this is why i'm angry so why they were dishing the food right the men like somebody still had to acknowledge the men that that they should give food to the men my problem is not even the that they should give food to the men first my problem is that okay we have contributions we have contributed for food and some of these men that they are claiming that they should give them food first they did not contribute on time and they even came late you get what i'm saying so and then why some some of the uh, some of the women were saying that they should give food to the men because they are men i was so angry but i could not really express myself because it's going to be as if i'm biased you get so you, th there was even supposed to be a penalty it it was like if you are you have not contributed they are not even supposed to eat and how can you be contributing in the meeting that they have already cooked the food and still they want to give you food first because you are a man like and it is still it is not that it is an elder it is not an elder person it is an age group something age group means we are mates you get so i'm just so angry i am just so angry that every even on social media where i see people always hyping the men like it is like a woman has to be a certain way for a man to get married to that woman like why do you have to be a good woman or why do you have to have a certain criteria like you have to do this to attract men like why do men not also have to do that to attract women like why can't it not also be the other way around you get what I'm saying? Like, why can't it also, like, that? Uh, when I was discussing with one of my friends, she told me that the man always has his place as the man. 
and the woman is always behind the man i'm not saying that i want to be in front i want to be the head i don't want to be the head here i don't know if you guys are understand me i don't want to be the head the point what i'm trying to say is that why does a woman have to go an extra mile for a man why so guys what i'm trying to say is that it's not that i want women to be the head or i'm interested it's, it's not just it, it's not all about that it is just that i don't know why a lot of pressure a lot of pressure is being put on women they are pressurizing the pressure they do pressure pressurize women a lot in the society and that is annoying like i don't know if i'm that kind of a human being that i'm just out of space out of this in fact i don't know if what i'm thinking is i don't know it i don't get it like i'm not with the pressure like i'm not with people saying that a woman has to you have to have certain kind like a woman has to do this for a man even women like just imagine the case where um it's y'all a doche and the second wife in nigeria right y'all a doche left his wife and went ahead and uh, um had fornication with this other lady and got this lady impregnated and this lady gave birth without the wife knowing without the knowledge of the wife you get and then when somebody comes up and say my new family the wife does not even know but the first people the first person that they started criticizing was the woman the second like the woman is a this the woman is a that who is the main person here did that woman chap you charm y'all a doche like why is most of the blame going but on the woman like why is it not y'all a doche like why is he not the one that is carrying the most part because from what i see people are calling the woman all kind of names the second wife all kinds of name like and y'all a doche is odogu or how do they call it in nigeria i don't even care but meanwhile that man only that man for me eh, that man is the is only the man that is the problem because that man is the one that is married this girl was not married the other girl was not married you get she's doing what she's doing not that i'm encouraging it but i'm just saying that they blame they were supposed to focus instead to focus on the man they are focusing on the lady died she's a home breaker a blah 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 did she rape the man like i'm i'm just in fact the the me a daughter is my idol because i like that woman because she has not even said anything she's writing but to y'all that i don't have anything to do with that lady because the man is the one that decided to go and do that not the other way around it is not the woman what what do you mean by seduce like the woman seduce him like it does not in fact i don't even my my point is that they okay another example this boya this boya girl right this lady in boya that instead when and met but the side chick this lady that she's claiming that she's the main chick she went and met by the side chick and humiliated this girl instead of humiliating the boy that betrayed you come and sit down yes let me open it instead of humiliating the boy that betrayed you you went and humiliate the girl that did not do anything not that the girl did not elect the shift not that the girl did not really do anything but still the big person that you were supposed to that the girl was supposed to humiliate was the boy not the girl i don't know if you guys are understanding my point like i don't even i don't even get the the and then i don't even get the point and then at the end of the day at the end of the day everything is about the pressure is on the women it is the woman it is the what what about the boy what about the boy why are they not damn it? Why are they not insulting the boy? Why are they not so insulting the boy? Why are they not insulting them? Always is the woman. Always is the woman. Always is the woman. 
like i'm just sick, sick and tired of this shit so guys what i'm what i'm really trying to say is that i'm just so tired of women the pressure that they put on women like women this women that in fact if i want to start putting you if i want to start giving you examples like Bana boy also still nigeria Bana boy in nigeria right she went to a club and there is this married woman with her husband you get Bana boy actually wanted something to uh, wanted to talk to this a uh, uh, married woman i don't know if the news is true but from what i see on social media Bana boy wanted this lady and he approached this lady and when the lady refused it was a problem until the club was shut down and he flee but now when this came up i saw people commenting People were not focusing on Bonner Boy. They were not focusing on him. They were focusing on the woman because the woman is married. So they were focusing on the woman that what was the woman doing in the club if the woman is married? First of all, I see comments like, why was the woman, first of all, there? Like, why was a married woman, first of all, doing in the club? That, And people were there liking the comment. I was like, really? really so the problem now is the woman <laughs> like are married people not even supposed to go to the club like i don't in fact i don't just understand like seriously in fact my head my head is your ache like i'm just so at times say eh, it frustrates it first it is frustrating it is frustrating like i don't i don't just i'm just confused because i don't know why women are the ones what about the women what about we don't even want the men to be breeding like seriously the woman has to do this the woman has to do that the woman has to the woman has to be to do like this for the man the woman has to do let's okay yes if you want to talk about the bible let's talk about the bible eh? so in the bible the punishment the punishment that yes mama the punishment that god gave was that a woman is supposed to carry a baby for nine months and labor after that nine months and give birth to a child why the man is supposed to till the soil yes why the man is supposed to till the soil that is how it was supposed to be but are women not working are we talking about that are women not working and eh? are women not working so in fact they still have no balance at all but anyhow guys <sighs> at times my frustrations when i'm when i'm always like when i was coming back today the thing was just pumping in my head and i just said that day let me share with you guys what are your thoughts like what are your thoughts you get 